The county of Mombasa and the stand the state house is issuing a statement. This comes amid the calls by Azmila Umoja One Kenya Coalition to urge its supporters to remember the victims of the strikes that took place in the country. Jine Karisa is in Mombasa. Let's cross over and listen in. So, Kila Rais Ambaya Nakuja Kenya, or any president who comes to meet the president of Kenya, there are established protocols in the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. Okay? So, they will communicate and they will handle all the protocol, and of course, we will know uh, that a president or a visiting head of state or president has come to meet the president of the republic. Of course, that is not to say. Uh, a, a president cannot can come to a country or cannot come to a country to, for holiday or whatever. But for all the presidents that have come to meet the President of the Republic of Kenya, it has been documented. Uh, we have all seen that several heads of state have come to meet the President of Kenya through established protocols in the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. I think that, that is the best person to address that question to. Okay? Uh, you had asked me about uh, Dongo Kundu. Uh, of course, it came with some impacts to the locals, the locals uh, in terms of resettlement. So since uh, November to date, uh, the resettlement of project affected persons is as follows. Uh, the planning, survey, and beaconing of 491 acres for resettlement of these people is complete. Printing of 1,648 title deeds, again, is complete. Uh, in terms of compensation, out of 1,756, 1,360, that's about 77%, have received and accepted the awards. Okay? Uh, the handling of grievances of the remainder is, go is ongoing, of course, through the National uh, Lands Commission. I hope I've uh, answered your question. And, of course, uh, on the other hand, we have the EPZA. I think it's just good to give you an update. Uh, Export Processing Zone Authority. 12 zones have been gazetted since uh, November as designated areas where several investors in different sectors will operate. And these investments uh, in, in, to, are totaling to about 924 million and have created in that about six or eight month period, 2,400 uh, jobs. There was another question, I think, on um, operations. Yes, that was a pledge the president made, and I would kindly urge us to be patient. He'll come here and he'll tell us, and he'll tell all of you, of course, uh, the impact. But just briefly, since uh, between January and June this year, uh, increase in cargo has gone up by 3.3 percent, of course, uh, since uh, the president uh, made that decision. And uh, additionally, container traffic during the same period increased by about 8.5 percent. And we have the exact uh, figures that I can share uh, with you. There was another question, I believe, on uh, police uh, brutality. Alleged, that's what I'll, I'll tell you to, the word I'll tell you to use is, I'll urge you to use is alleged, okay? But, uh, of course, you know the police is an independent uh, organ or organization. We must respect and uphold their independence, and the president has always reiterated that. Uh, so I'll just, my brother, I'll refer you to the statement by the CS Interior uh, last night or yesterday, if you saw. He made his position uh, on this matter clear, uh, on claims of police brutality. Uh, and, of course, he said those claims are false, malicious, and intended to distort public opinion regarding the recent orgy of violence that took place in some parts of the country. I am actually reading word for word a few words verbatim of what he said, because we respect the independence of the police and all the other uh, institutions. I think that's it. Kuna swali moja ya... Kuna swali moja ya Africa, Africa, Africa Russia Summit. Si mumekua mkiusikiza raisa ki katika ziara zake za nje and what he has been saying and the reforms that he has been pushing 
Uh, but of course, this is even beyond him in terms of reforms for at, at, at the African Union. Uh, the president say, uh, has always said, and of course it's a decision by the African Union, that for, for Africa uh, to have a better engagement within a, within a framework with other uh, external entities, whether it's a nation or whether it's a, it's, it's, it's a union or a, a region, for example, EU or a country like Russia, if they want uh, to engage Africa, a decision was made by the African Union heads of state. They decided that they will be represented by organs of the African Union to such meetings, because that goes beyond a one-on-one -on -one meeting or bilateral uh, meeting between a president and a president. It's between Russia and Africa, and the organ, therefore, that represents Africa, according to that decision of the assembly, is the African Union. So he'll be represented according to that decision of the African Union. Asante ni sana, na shukuru sana. Asante. Asante.